Hello everyone, this is Jay Kalpana here. In this video, we are going to see a problem from partial differential equations by eliminating the arbitrary function. So, let's get going. Problem, form partial differential equation by elimination of arbitrary function from z equal to x plus y plus f of x, y. So, here we are given an equation and we are asked to form a partial differential equation by eliminating the arbitrary function f from this equation. So, let's see. given z equal to x plus y plus f of x y consider as equation number one now let's partially differentiate it with respect to x and one i mean x and y i'll begin with x partially differentiating one with respect to x i'll apply dou by dou x on both sides of one you can skip this step if you can do directly okay this gives us dou z by dou x equal to dou by dou x of first term of rhs plus dou by dou x of second term of rhs plus dou by dou x of last term our third term of rhs here we are partially differentiating with respect to x so we'll treat y as constant and we know that z is a function of x and y right z is a dependent variable fine this equals to we have notation dou z by dou x equal to p let's replace dou z by dou x by p okay this gives us p equal to Partial derivative of x with respect to x is 1 plus partial derivative of a constant with respect to x is 0 plus partial derivative of f of xy is f dash of xy into inner derivative that is dou by dou x of xy. Okay, this gives us p equal to 1 plus f dash of xy. Here y is a constant, right? So we can write this as y into dou by dou x of this x right because here x y is in product form so we can take y as constant outside the derivative you'll get y into dou by dou x of x fine this gives us p equal to 1 plus f dash of x y into y into derivative of x with respect to x is 1 this is y into 1 not y of 1 okay y into 1 otherwise you can write like this fine this gives us p equal to 1 plus y into f dash of x y now Let's bring this 1 to LHS. We'll get P minus 1 equal to Y into F dash of XY. Consider as equation number 2. Fine. Now we got equation 2. Let's partially differentiate 1 with respect to Y. Partially differentiating 1 with respect to y okay i'll apply dou by dou y on both sides of one here we are partially differentiating one with respect to y so we'll treat x as constant we get dou z by dou y equal to dou by dou y of first term of rhs plus dou by dou y of uh, second term of rhs plus dou by dou y of last term or third term of rhs fine since we have a notation dou z by dou y equal to q so let's replace dou by dou y sorry it's dou z by dou y by q and get q equal to partial derivative of a constant with respect to y is zero since we are Partially differentiating with respect to y, so we'll read this x as constant. So you'll get partial derivative of a constant with respect to y is 0 plus 
partial derivative of y with respect to y is 1 plus partial derivative of f of x y with respect to y is f dash of x y into inner derivative that is dou by dou y of x into y. Here y is constant right. So we will write this as q equal to 1 plus f dash of x y into we will write this as constant into dou by dou y of variable y. This gives us q equal to 1 plus f dash of x y into x into partial derivative of y with respect to y is 1. x into partial derivative of y with respect to y is 1. Okay. Fine. This gives us q or just bring this 1 to LHS. You will get q minus 1 equal to x into f dash of x y. Consider as equation number say 3. Okay. Now observe 2 and 3 into you having p minus 1 equal to y into f dash of x y and in 3 you are having q minus 1 equal to x into f dash of x y. Right. So, if you if we'll try 2 by 3 that is 2 divided by 3 f dash gets removed. Right. Fine. Now from 2 and 3 we have p minus 1 equal to y into f dash of x y which is our equation 2 and q minus 1 equal to x into f dash of x y which is our equation number 3. Now 2 by 3 gives p minus 1 by q minus 1 equal to y into f dash of x y by x into f dash of x y where f dash of x y gets cancelled and you'll get p minus 1 by q minus 1 equal to y by x right now make a cross multiplication we'll get x into p minus 1 equal to y into q minus 1 right which uses x p minus x equal to y q minus y or px minus x equal to qy minus y right now bring this qy to lhs and take this x to rhs you will get px minus qy equal to x minus y which is the required partial differential equation which completes the problem. Well, we have seen a problem from partial differential equations in this video. I hope you'll understand. We'll see you in the next video. Until then, bye-bye.